Hey everyone, PTL here. So I'm just gonna go through some of the nice gifts my family got me for Christmas. And uh, I got some nice food items and some nice equipment. So I'm gonna show you that in a minute. Praise the Lord. Okay, I have everything spread out here on the table. And we'll go through it real quick. So I got four of these Mountain House dinners. So I've got two chicken and dumplings, which is my favorite. There's a chicken and fried rice, chicken fried rice, and a turkey dinner. Uh, there's also some beef jerky, Jack Link's original, a couple Nor sides, rice pilaf, and rice medley. Got some whey protein bars, three of those, as well as some fruit rolls. Got some Propel, which is an electrolyte mix. It's grape, I really like that. Gives good flavor to your drinking water as well as get the electrolytes. Got three of these uh, Lenny and Larry's Complete Cookies. This one is uh, Snickerdoodle. We've got Oatmeal Raisin and Peanut butter chocolate chip. A bit lighter. I'm not sure if I can mail that down to myself. Um, when I go on the plane, I don't want to check things in. I'm going to carry on, so I'm going to mail some stuff down to be there when I get there. So I'm going to try to mail that. If not, I'm going to have to buy a lighter when I get there. Some M&Ms. I've got a, a chicken creations lunch. Uh, some... Slim Jims, and then there's a bunch of these vegetable and fruit uh, snacks. Uh, these two here are beans and kale, and you got carrots. Uh, here's a beans and looks like peas. We got banana fruit snack. And that's actually apple and banana. This one's apple and blueberry. And apple and mango. So a lot of good food snacks. I probably can't take all of it with me, but most of that will go with me. And if I have to leave anything behind, then uh, my wife will mail it to me. So I also have this uh, Z-Packs dry bag. Again, the Z-Packs uses the Dyneema material so this is going to be a dry bag for my clothes and again I'm going to use a uh, trash compactor bag inside my pack so a little extra protection and then uh, when I take the clothes out of the bag if it gets wet or damp inside my tent then uh, there'll be some protection for the clothes I want to keep dry I also have the Z-Packs food bag so both of these bags are uh, very light and uh, going to save weight over what I currently have. Based on recommendations from a number of people, uh, including, let's see, Wild on the Trail and I believe the Vintage Hikers. And there was one other person, I can't remember who it was, recommended the Aegis Max booties. So I did get those for Christmas. I have some Gore-Tex mittens, the waterproof ones. Uh, so again, those will go over. I have mittens uh, with the fold down mitt and so you can expose your fingers, but these I'll use if it rains. Two pair of Injinji toe socks to go under my darn tough socks. Uh, I got an spare uh, card for my GoPro and I'm not going to be using the cloud I'm going to take my pictures and film onto the SD card and then transfer it to my phone where I'll make the uh, make eye movies so uh, that's a I have one and that's a backup now I have a uber gift card which will come in handy if I need to get a ride into town for resupply or uh, to charge my batteries up and I've got the dirty girl 
gaiters. These are the uh, Velcro stick-ons that go on your shoes for the heel. Those are, I like the color in those, those are nice. I also got the uh, Gossamer Gear umbrella. I've never used an umbrella before hiking. So I'm gonna give it a try. I've watched some other people and how they hook them up onto their pack because I like to use my hiking sticks. So, but uh, I did use it in the driveway the other day when I was doing my uh, exercise, the, the leg uh, lunges step lunges and uh, it was raining out so that came in handy for that my son actually picked me up this little swiss army knife this is the mini one it has a knife scissors and there's tweezers in the end there's also another uh, pick on it and one other item that aren't as important but this is really lightweight and uh, i'll go into that more when i do a complete gear overview or weight savings but this is extremely light and uh, I got rid of my other Swiss Army type knife as well as the other knife I was going to use that was pretty light this is even lighter so that's what I'm going with so I, actually that was from my son and daughter-in-law for Christmas and then I got the body glide as well as uh, gold bond friction defense so I'll take one of those with me. Both of them are good for chafing. I'll use them both on my feet. I was using the uh, foot glide on my feet. So I'll use the body glide or the other one. I heard of this other one after my wife had already picked up the body glide. So she got me both. So those will be good to uh, use on my feet and other areas where there's some friction. My daughter got me a nice tempered glass screen protector. I have one on my phone right now that's getting scratched up and banged up from my rough use of it. And I have the received these rubber tips which uh, go on the end of my poles for when you're in the rocks. So uh, when I get up in Pennsylvania, these will probably come in handy. So again, they were very good to me. A lot of nice gear and food. So I'm going to be doing an updated video of all my gear, and uh, I'll do first do one on my big three, and then I'll do a total gear review with all my items and get an overall weight of what I have. Thanks for watching. Praise the Lord. Okay, and one more gift I wanted to show. This was a gift for my wife, which fits for my channel because it says, Be still and know that I am God, Psalm 46.10. And that's what my YouTube channel is based on. Be still on the trail, based on Psalm 46.10.